After months of being locked out, Lansing's Friendship Baptist Church held its first service in its recently approved building. A long-standing feud between two congregations shut the church down in June. The doors may be open again, but as Joy Wang reports, the feud may not be over. The doors of Friendship Baptist Church are open once again. There has been some difficulty at Friendship regarding uh, two uh, elements within the church who claim proper ownership and proper uh, title to the church. One congregation had locked the other out, damaging the locks, forcing the city to shut down the church. Our primary focus is to make sure that uh, the rules of uh, uh, law and order are uh, in place and that people operate and govern themselves according to the law and of course that uh, the proper procedures are in place to ensure that the building is safe. A few months and a lawsuit later, the church is now holding Sunday service in the building. They're very uh, uh, happy to be uh, with each other and to share in the ministry. We are today uh, beginning um, to make use of our church once again for worship. Now that Friendship Baptist Church is open, the city hopes both congregations will work together to resolve any issues that may have led to the church closing in the first place. It is our expectation that this is going to be uh, the beginning of a peaceful either coexistence or peaceful resolution. News 10 tried to get a hold of the other congregation at Friendship Baptist Church, but they could not be reached. Pastor Carnegie also tells me he hasn't had any contact with the other group. But he says his church is simply thankful they can now use the building. We're looking forward. We're not looking backwards. In Lansing, Joy Wang, Fox 47 News. The congregation had been holding services off-site or even in the parking lot while the building was closed. But now that it's open again, the church says it will resume weekly services inside.